Introducing Rewired Mind. Alan Plunkett interviews industry leaders and decision makers about challenges. I was there in the house, the prostitute had left us, and we did that for three weeks. And here I was as the 12 year old having to take care of my brothers and sisters and to live with that stress, that thought, oh my gosh, if they turn off the electricity, what are we going to do? Payroll, sales, balance sheets, income statements, nothing has ever been more stressful than that three weeks. That sense of powerlessness can seem as if it's too much to bear. No one expected much from me. I went to live with my Uncle Bobby, and my Uncle Bobby had four kids of his own, and, you know, to take me in as well and feed me, clothe me, treat me as one of his own. He never treated me any different. That was the first time anyone had shown me follow-through. I did not know what follow-through was up until that point. Years, my dad would say, hey, I'm going to come pick you up, and I'd stand in the window five hours, and he'd never show. And that was a huge lesson for me. You know, I worked hard and in turn, my Uncle Bobby kept his word and that became a big life lesson for me that I still keep to this day. Keep your word, work hard and drive results. But until then, no one had ever shown me what it was like to to keep your word or to keep follow through. Alan Plunkett interviews industry leaders and decision makers about turning points, challenges and gets their insights about what helped them find that new approach that ultimately launched them into success. We try to bring you stories that inspire, stories we can all relate to about rewiring how we think, how we live, and most importantly, how we can change. A new podcast series called Rewired Mind. Visit our website at rewiredmindpodcast.com.